breathe isn't just oxygen. It's a mixture of gases. Each of these gases contributes part of the atmospheric pressure that we feel. Nitrogen produces 79.11 kilopascals of pressure. Oxygen produces 21.22 kilopascals. Carbon dioxide produces 0.04. And argon and other gases produce 0.95 kilopascals of pressure. All of these together add up to 101.3 kilopascals, which is the standard unit of pressure for our atmosphere. Partial pressure is the contribution of each gas to the total pressure. Dalton's law of partial pressure states that in a mixture of gases, the total pressure is the sum of the partial pressures of the gases, and that can be written as an equation like this. Now, it seems pretty obvious because it just makes sense that all of these would add up to the total. If the composition of the mixture remains the same, the fraction of the pressure exerted by each gas will be the same as well. Now, gases can diffuse and effuse, which sounds similar because they actually are very similar. If you've ever smelled an open perfume bottle or a candle from across the room, it's because particles are diffusing across the room. These molecules will tend to move from an area of high concentration to an area of low concentration until it reaches some kind of equilibrium. In effusion, gases escape through tiny holes in its container. Balloons have very small pores in the rubber surface, and gases will slowly effuse through these holes. So over time, a balloon will shrink in size as gas escapes. Thanks for watching this episode of Teacher's Pet. Don't forget to like and subscribe and follow me on Twitter at SciencePet.